September 29th, 2.34 a.m. RPD oh, it's whiskey. It's been a while. Subway's got to be clear of the city by now. Yeah, everyone's dead. <gasps> no, nah, she's not like that. Hell, she's not like anybody. They respect each other's strength. I like it. <gasps> all right. Keep your head okay. screwed on Romeo. Okay, okay, all right. All sure? right. It looks like a cemetery to me. <laughs> I'm so excited. I get to play as Carlos. <laughs> okay, okay. So this is where we played Resident Evil 2. This is where Claire was. And... Oh yeah, we get to be the lovely Carlos. Looking good, my man. Alright. This is the same area as Resident Evil 2. How interesting. Can I talk to you? Oh, alright. What, what, what items do I have? Oh, snap! We got a handgun, we got this gun. Alright. I dig it. Stop! T. Come on, man. Not you too. Hey, it's Marvin. Sorry. Sorry. Oh no! That's how he got bit. Oh, that's so sad. Locked. Oh, it's so cool how this is connected to two. You stay oh. on the door. I got this fucker. Oh no, Marvin. Don't get so. It's Brad from the beginning of the game. Now he's a zombie. Yep. These stars. It's open. That could be useful. <gasps> we get to go inside the police department. Oh, this is so cool! This is literally overlapping Resident Evil Two. This is so exciting. So we're in the. Uh... Oh hey! Oh wait! This is new. Wait, what is this? It's like. Oh, this is where we. Oh. Oh, okay, just kidding. We weren't we weren't in the area where Jill was. Or sorry, not Jill, Claire. I don't think. This looks really familiar though. Oh no, it was. Sorry, I'm all mixed up. Okay, if I go this way, this is where Claire went. The other way was not open. Haha. -ha. But yeah, the guy that just got bit, Marvin, he's a cop, he, when Resident Evil 2 starts and Leon goes into the police station, he's already bit. So we're, we're seeing what happened before Leon gets there. Sorry, poster boy. Hmm. Brad, he was the poster boy. Email outbox. Lucy Yen. Department in chaos after spread of infection. Multiple citizens taking refuge here are infected. All files related to you successfully deposed of, awaiting further orders. Communications intercepted by S. Hospi Hosp Hospital on STARS private communications line. Presumed to be evac request from B. Possible he will flee the hospital and come here. Request UBCS dispatch. I will activate with their assistance. Requested evac has not yet arrived. The, this position is becoming untenable. Uh, I, I remained here with the condition my safety would be guaranteed. If I am left to die here, I will distribute proof of co collusion and corruption between you and RC's civic leaders. You have one hour to deliver a response. Oh, uh-oh. Yikes. Looks like they tried to, um... Time to put his blues on. <laughs> What? Oh, okay. I don't I don't pick up anything. All right. Yeah, I wonder if we're going to see Claire. I mean, she didn't get here until after Leon too, so 
maybe they'll miss each other. It would be cool to see them though. Like at the end when we're leaving the station. I'm so excited to go into the police station. I don't think we're gonna go through the whole place, but it's pretty cool. Where'd that cop go? <sighs> no, no, don't care. What's the job to do? If our intel's still worth a damn, then Bard's in the star's office. Let's find him and take him into custody. Custody? I thought this was a rescue. Carlos. Take a look at this. I've located the star's office. Remember, Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. Hmm. Right. Good to know. I'll open the shutter so you can get through. You stay here and find out what's been going on here at the station. Call you if I find anything. Okay. Hey! Be careful. Oh, this is so cool. We get to go in the police station again. I like this area. This was probably my favorite area of um, Resident Evil 2. You know, I don't know. Uh, I guess I'll put that in there for now. Just to be safe. This is so cool. Let's go. Cool. I love this. Now here's a weird fucking door. <laughs> We're here for Bard. Oh. <laughs> I love him. I mean, it make it be. They made an old museum into a police department, and they have doors that have random symbols on them. I mean, I, I guess that's weird. <laughs> Looks clear. I just want to see what what I can go to. I like how this is covered. The statue. I, now I'm curious. Like, I bet it was the the one guy that's still alive in the police station who wrote the journal. Oh, that's convenient. Conveniently blocked. I can't go anywhere else. I can't redo Resident Evil 2, man. Alright. Let me check this side real quick. Never know if we can go anywhere. Another spade key. We don't have the spade key. Wrong game, Carlos. Still pretty cool though. Oh, whoops, I went too far. Oh, this stuff. ID card security protocols. Each member of the force has been issued an ID card. From now on, the same card will be required to access all storage boxes. Do not lend your card to anyone. Take great care in using it. If your card goes missing, report it lost immediately. Interesting. This is fancy. <laughs> and we got some ammo. Nice. What else do I have? All right, let's combine these. We have a full thing. And then, look at this, it's the same. Ah! <laughs> Just not as big. There's a liquor in this area in Resident Evil 2, so. <gasps> what the 
hell was that thing? Is it the liquor? It might be the liquor. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Couldn't have been a zombie. Oh my, that's oh. <sighs> Hello, Kiki. The liquors can't see. So usually when they when they show up, um, I panic and run, which is the, the opposite of what you should do. <laughs> we have we have lovely claw marks. I didn't stick around. Hmm. Oh, okay. Maybe it left. Oh. Uh. Here we go. Lovely. Can I do quick step as Carlos? Oh, what is this? Stop it, lady. Enough. Right. Big warm RPD. <sighs> Goodness gracious. Got me good. There's a flash grenade. Wow. This really is Resident Evil 2. <laughs> Alrighty. And we get some more ammo. Nice, nice. Locker room. Hey, Cap. You copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty? <gasps> Alright. I'll take a look with the cameras. Watch your six. The jump scares are insane. I know, they get me so good. Sometimes, sometimes I'm okay, but most of the time I fall for it. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the heart key. Oh god, why are there so many of you? Maybe I should use the flash grenade, that would be smart. Sweet. All right, we gotta figure out where to go. Where are we going? Oh man, I'm doing this again. What happens if I do this? Oh, okay. All right. I will. I. It kind of his his quick step is more like a just punch you sort of thing. So I I didn't. All right. That's the west office. Can I go to the safety deposit room? Oh snap! Stop it! Hey! Hey! Get off me! Dude! I wanna see what's back here. <laughs> I know if we see Mr. X, that would be wild. Wild. I would I would I miss him. He was so much nice. He was 
He was so much nicer than Mr. X. Can I go in here? <gasps> I can go in the dark room? This is so wild. I, I still am in disbelief that we are here. Like, this is crazy. Well, if cameras killed those things, I'd be set. <laughs> so much ammo. So much ammo. What's this? Internal memo. Office supply, internal relocation notice. Heat resistant number three, combination safe to stars. 9157. Alright. Alrighty. Oh, there's the red light. I can go upstairs? No way! Carlos, the star's office is up ahead. Uh, Copy that. Uh, wait, but I want to look at the other... I want to look at the rest of the place. I want to go to the west office and the safety deposit room. Can I go on the third floor? This guy. What? Dude, I can go like almost everywhere. <gasps> we got a key! This looks different though. That key doesn't look the same. Oh, okay. Is this cap? Aw, what? Ah, uh, what was it? Oh, what is it? Oh, I played this. I did this. I played this game. Yeah, it's a different key. It's not the spade key. It's it's a different. It's a new key. I'm trying to remember what the password was for here. There is one that has the password cap, but it's not this one. Hmm. We'll find it. We'll find it. Okay, so we gotta get the... Oh! Come on, dude! Really? Oh! Bit my ankle! You jerk face! He's dead until he decides to not be dead anymore. I could have sworn the password was... <sighs> Dang it. Alright, I want to check out the west office really quick. Before we go up here. Oh, come on, dudes. Why you gotta all be here? Really? <sighs> ay 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 Right. Just kidding, we're going to the star's office. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is it blocked? <laughs> hmm. Okay, this one is cap. Okay. Oh, hey. 
Oh no. Hang on. Okay. Guess we'll be doing this the explodey way. <laughs> uh okay. Nice, nice. Oh, we need- Oh, we need the battery. That's right. Yes. That's all coming back to me now. Note to a friend. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it, please. While you were out on patrol, I focused on finding a way to get to the other side. I realized that explosive might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, but we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during intake last week. We need that battery if we're going to knock this wall down. So I headed upstairs to find you since I know you have the safety deposit room key. Oh, as soon as I left the shower room, I was attacked. One of them bit me. I washed the wound as best I could, but I feel worse and worse. I hope I didn't... I hope I don't need to spell out why you must not open the locker. Please don't worry about me. Just get yourself out of here fast as you can. Your buddy, Wes. Don't worry about that $600 I lent you. Think of it as a gift towards your upcoming move. Good luck, buddy. Aww. That's so sad because when you're in... When you're playing Resident Evil 2, he does come out of the locker. This guy. Yeah, that's him. He's in there. Should we open it? Should we say hi? It says don't open the locker. I can't remember if there's an item in there. It's probably just him. <laughs> Alright, well, we're gonna have to head this way anyway. Come on. Dang it. Come on, dude. Y'all better be dead. For reals. <gasps> Come on. Shit, shit, shit. We got him. I think we got it. Yeah. Oh my. That was that was a lot. Oh, here it is. The key is for this, I... Okay. Yeah, this is the key, I think. Aha! There's a dude in here. There you are. Hello. We're missing the keys. There's nothing in there. What's that noise? Oh no! Eh.
I'm just sure. I'm gonna put this stuff back in the box. It's nice that I'm like familiar with this area already. this west office yet, so let's check out this place. Hello, keycard. Let's go. Ooh. Yes, please. Nice. Aha. Uh -huh. I like it. I like it. Except 20. Rest. A rest report. Rodney Gray, unemployed, former electrician, charges, unlawful creation or and or possession of explosives. Suspect was seen behaving suspiciously at 1442 Box Street on September 18th, 1998. Suspect's person was searched, producing a small explosive and a time detonator from his inside pocket, leading to arrest on the charges listed above. A search of suspect's home found more than 20 additional homemade explosives at various stages of completion. Suspect was extremely agitated and not of sound mind. Suspect spoke feverishly when, when questioning began, and at one point, questioning had to be halted due to a sudden bout of shrieking from suspect. Once questioning was resumed, suspect made the following statements. I didn't do it for me. I did it for you. Why doesn't anyone understand? The corpse is attacked from the shadows. A storm's coming, but this umbrella is no good. Gotta blow it up or you'll be more than just wet. Gotta get more bombs. They're coming. Soon. Gotta hurry. Burn them. Burn the corpses. Burn them good. During questioning, the suspect began to shake violently before resuming a shrieking fit. Questioning was ended and a sed sedative was administered. Note, due to suspect's unstable psychiatric condition, suspect's testimony changed from moment to moment. Suspect's delirium made any sort of dialogue impossible. We are currently awaiting the results of a doctor's investigation to suspect's condition. The explosives collected from the suspect's person and residence appear to be extremely powerful. As a safety precaution, a battery was removed from one detonation device upon its admission to the oh, into evidence. Okay, so we've already taken care of this. We already have the battery, but it was cool to get some backstory. Apparently there was a dude. It's Leon Kennedy's desk. It's covered. Nice. Nice, nice. Hello. I hear you. I'm like running out of space. Oh, hello. I think you're good. You're done. Donezo. Oh, what was the password? It was... 9157. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, it pouch. The best. Now we can get this stuff. Nice. Sweet. 
Good thing I came back down here. I want to know what the other locker combo is, though. Hmm. Maybe the answer is in the star's office. There's this one. Cap locker room. Yeah, okay. So we've had that one. But I haven't seen the other one. Is there something in here? Hmm. Probably not. All right, moving on. To the second floor we go! To Call see. Copy that. All right. So we have the battery. Oh, that's right. We're supposed to combine it. Oh my god. So that's what causes the explosion. Oh, 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 oh! Oh dear. Oh dear. I should have used the should have used a grenade. That would have been smart. One at a time. Take a number. Oh my God! Are you kidding me? Die. Beaches. Beaches. Oh. Goodness. These freaking zombies. Sorry, so we can't go back this way. <sighs> That's right, I forgot about that. Alright, alright, alright. Isn't this cool how it's all connecting? I like it. Huh. <gasps> Where are you? Why are you right on? You're literally right on top of me. I, I. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh my. Oh no. Oh dear. I think I am danger. Yes, yes, I am danger. We are now fine, and you're dead. Maybe. Look at it it's still twitching. Gross. Hey, nope. Oh my goodness. Why is this music so intense? Okay, uh, here's the star's office, but I want to see what's this way first. It 
the linen room that I can't go. Why is it so dark? My goodness. Okay, cool. We got some more ammo. Music really gets me. And and so do dark, creepy hallways, yeah. Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Did you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, negative. RPD's overrun too. Then figure it out. Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. Well, well then. Already. <laughs> yeah, you would. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. That's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. Mm. This will take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. Will do. That's that's what I do. I always look for the things. <laughs> Yeah, so they they are like um the, they have an umbrella symbol on their on their uh uniforms cuz they're they're not part of the police department. They're a different force. So UBCS is the name of their uh thing. It's a private military force owned by Umbrella specializing in rescue operations during biohazard outbreaks. I feel like Carlos is a good guy, and he wants to help people, and that's why he works for them, but I don't think he realizes that his his company is, like, actually, um, bad, and they, um, you know, create bioweapons and kind of cause this entire zombie outbreak. And I'm, I'm assuming that some of the people who are in the military force might be aware of it. Like, that really sketchy Russian guy who killed the dude in the beginning when Jill was like, WTF? I'm thinking he's he's bad. So, uh, we'll see. We'll see. I don't know. Okay. So, he's busy with this. Oh, nice. We're... Okay. Oh, look at all this stuff. We are ready to be healed. Oh, hey, there's a box. Nice. Put that in there, and uh, that. Flash grenade, I'll take that, and we're good. I think we are good. Oh, yeah, and we have this one. Nice. Alright, cool. Report on the mansion incident. Okay, I'm assuming this is the mansion in Resident Evil 1. This is what they're talking about. This bizarre incident occurred in a mansion owned by the Umbrella Corporation located in the Arclay Mountains. On July 23rd, Star's Bravo team was dispatched to the Arclay Mountains to investigate a series of mysterious and grisly murders and went unexpectedly radio silent. On July 24th, Alpha team was dispatched as well and became entangled in the events at the nearby mansion. The incident accumulated in the oh sorry culminated in the discretion of the mansion casualties were numerous the only survivors were five members of stars the cause of the incident was the illegal bioweapon experiments being carried out in a secret umbrella lab beneath the mansion the t-virus being used in these experiments escaped the facility and is presumed to be the root cause of all that occurred however all evidence was destroyed along with the mansion so further investigation has proven to be extremely difficult 
Is that Jill in the front row? Oh yeah, she's right there at the bottom right, almost almost at the end. Ah, is that Wesker? Huh. Where's Chris? I can't tell which one is Chris Redfield. Is he the one in the very middle? I don't know. Alrighty. <laughs> Got some cool backstory on Resident Evil 1 just now. Nice, nice. Um, guess I'll put this in there. Okay. Oh, wait. Is this a... <laughs> Discard. Yes. Maybe I'll keep one more heal on me, just to be safe. Okay. I think there's nothing else in here. I do want to figure out the code for that one lock locker, though. I haven't seen anything yet. I already picked up that. Nothing here. Okay. Let's move on. Yeah, what's up? Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill? Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bard. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, am I gonna be Jill again? Do I get my items that I left in the box? <laughs> I never got the locker. I didn't I didn't open the locker. Dang it. <sighs> Several minutes earlier, subway tunnels. This girl, this 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 woman has been through so much. First she goes to the zombie infested mansion and has traumatic experiences. Then she gets quarantined into her apartment. Then she gets attacked by another crazy dude who's out to get her. I'm the only one who made it. And oh. yep. No. Jeez, all the civilians that we were gonna save. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm assuming Nemesis is still chasing Jill. We're just not sure where Nemesis is right now. Carlos? Come in. Carlos? Oh, damn it. I guess I'm out of range. Mine rounds? Oh. Interesting. UBCS new weaponry notice. <clears throat> so this is the umbrella bio something service that. <laughs> Good news, limp dicks. <laughs> I've got some new weaponry for you that's guaranteed to put the brass back in your sacks. They're called mine rounds. These babies were developed by Umbrella's military R&D and they will fight your fires even hotter than the lover you left back home. They're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. All right, let's take a look at the specs. Mine rounds are designed for standard issue grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to load them in anything else. Fire them at walls or at the ground and they'll stay right where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate when they get within range. So basically just toss them in an enemy's path and you've got yourself a landmine. There's no such thing as unfair when you're taking on those giant freaks. So get out there and fight dirty. All right, that's exciting. Maybe we can set one in front of Nemesis, and then when he tries to chase us, he'll get attacked. That would be nice. <laughs> yeah, Jill's gonna need some therapy for sure. She's, she's seen some shit. Just a little bit. Wow, I have so many things. Alright, we'll, we'll get rid of the bolt cutters, because they're confusing me. The wire cutters, bolt cutters, whatever. Yes. 
Yes, discard. I need, I need more space. I need more hip pouches. I have so many, so many things. Hmm. I'm saving my gunpowder for other things. No, she didn't get the virus. She's good. Okie dokie. How are the monsters so good at hunting? Enough. Hmm. Hmm. This looks nice. Come on. Dude. Oh, hey. I didn't see you guys here. Two for one deal. That was the trophy. <laughs> nice. It's cool. Oh, is he going to wake up? Are you? Uh, okay. see any items in here I have enough items I really don't need to keep looking but I can't help myself all right I don't know where we are oh hello hello there nice Please stay dead. <laughs> okay. Nice. Walker's still alive. I can't stay here. Escape the creature. That is like our only objective in this entire game, basically. <sighs> Alright, well hang on. We have these, um mine rounds which i will try on him clock tower brochure saint michael's clock tower saint michael's clock tower is a baroque style building which stands at the heart of raccoon city it has become a beloved icon and residents consider it to be emblematic of the city as a whole St. Michael's Church erected this tower in 1908 with the assistance of several philanthropists. It was dis dedicated to the children born in the developing city, and the first floor was used as an elementary school for many years. The city saw further growth during its electrification over the course of the early 20th century, and the student body of St. Michael's Elementary swelled to over 600 students. Unfortunately, St. Michael's Elementary was shut shuttered in 1978 as the building began to show signs of age and wear. The clock was deactivated and strict limitations were placed on entry to the surrounding premises. Years passed with this once beloved monument and public plaza on lockdown, but in the 1990s, the Umbrella Corporation worked, with, worked in league with Mayor Michael Warren to renovate and reopen the area. This time, with proper preservation efforts in place, the clock tower was reopened in 1993 and today the sound of its heavy, tolling bells can be once again heard throughout Raccoon City. Huh. There it is. 
I thought they were talking about the orphanage for a second, but that's not it. <laughs> I'm like, oh, well, you know, Umbrella started a, an orphanage and uh, experimented on children. Great. Escape Nemesis. But where is he? Where are you? I'm waiting. I'm waiting for you. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Probably on that bridge, but I want to see if there's anything over here. Oh. Red herb. No, inventory full. No. Oh, finally, I found another one of these. This is very dark. Oh, and another green herb. Dude, I I need to find more hip pouches. I can't do this. Hmm. Well, whatever. At least I can pick up those herbs later if I really need them, but I don't have I don't have room for you. What's this? Red herb. Green herb. Yeah. This is fine. We're good. All right. Oh, oh. Ah, there he is. Lovely. He is ridiculous. Don't go in the water. Don't heal yourself. Bitch can't even swim. <laughs> Jill's so over oh, him already. I love it. Yeah, what's up? We didn't make it. The train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Oh, Nikolai left us to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? <gasps> it's back! Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! What the F? What the F? Holy shit. You are not human anymore. You weren't even human to begin with, but like... Now you're just like a water monster. The actual F. <laughs> oh my goodness. What? What? Looks like he mutated. Defeat the creature. I don't know how I'm supposed to dodge that, but okay. I think I've been eaten. I'm- I'm eaten. That's lovely. I'm alive? What? How am I alive? I'm only at caution? What? Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, come on. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Ah! Alright, we're out of this thing. I got a shotgun. I don't even know if I'm hitting you. I, I don't know what's going on. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to be doing, but... Oh god, oh god. What am I supposed to hit? Like, just hit you in general? 
Are you are you done? Are you done? The actual F is going on. I don't know where you are. Are you flying? Oh. Oh. What? What? All right. I'll If you're just going to run around, I'm just going to grab some items. <laughs> Except I have no room for them. Wow, it's a lot of shotgun shells. Combined to make bigger herb. Okay, here he comes. Oh, hello. Hello. Lovely. Love it. I don't know how Jill is still alive right now, but it's happening. We are at danger. Now we are fine. Where is he? hit you like this? Like, am I- Ah! Jesus Christ. Where are you? Are you running around again? Macaroni. Oh, shoot. Dang it. dead. If I get hit one more time, I'm dead. Oh, it runs out of time. Okay. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Oh. Dang it! I'm dead. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Car doors and trucks are usually... Will occasionally pop open from the shock of the creature's attacks. Be sure to check inside for useful, useful items in a pinch. Okay, um, so I'm not back before the fight. I'm at the fight again, so that's great. Let's try that again. Let's go. Come on! I feel like I got pretty far.
Oh, dang it. Dang it! Now he's gonna start running up, running around like a crazy person. Alright, we're fine. Um, I get some items now while we're here. Oh, dang it. Oh, another heal. That's good. Good to know. Two heals. Where'd he go? Where is he? opportunity to reload. down there. Nemesis. Holy macaroni. Oh god. Alright, now you're gonna run around because you're mad again. I'm supposed to do here. Oh dear. Ah! Dang it. <laughs> what? Oh dear. Okay. How many shotgun shells are you gonna take, bud? Holy crap. Dang it. Oh my goodness. Alright, do your thing. Do your thing, run around. Oh wait, where'd my herb go? What? need a heal. We're fine now, but I'm gonna need another heal eventually. Oh, did my heal go away? Oh, wait. Oh, he's right there. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do the mine rounds, but that's fine. Dang it! Dang it! Bullets are you gonna take? Oh! Oh! Right. Let's do this. Stop it! Carlos, you still there? Jeez! Oh my goodness! Holy crap. He's not done. 
Oh, wait. I didn't mean to do that. I should have looked at more items. Dang it. Holy crap. Dang it, I could have picked up some items. <laughs> oh, nemesis! Why? Oh no, you got stabbed with weird tentacle whatever that was. Oh no. Dude, this guy. <gasps> Interesting. You've done me a big favor. Miss. What the heck? What? My god, there's so many things happening. Roughly half a day later. What the F? Carlos! Aww. Hey, answer me. Dude, she's like god not doing it. so hot. Tyrell, do you copy? What's going on? Jill's been infected. I I'm taking her to the hospital. Maybe Dr. Bard can save her. Alright, I'll meet you there. Oh my goodness. What? Oh, oh man. You hang in there, super cop. I got you. Aww. I like it. I hope she'll be okay. Oh my goodness. Oh man. I'm a, I'm on normal difficulty. Not good. This is not good. Fight it, Jill. I'm gonna get you the vaccine. Oh no. Yeah, she's definitely infected okay. now. She got oh, infected. Oh, it's so cute. Um Oh, she's not doing so hot. Oh, we have to give her something. Can I give her first aid spray? <laughs> we need a special item to give her. This is intense. Oh, this game. I love it. I love this game. We still got our stuff. Oops. No, no, no. Sweet. Whoever's on Carlos's team, uh, that Nikolai guy, he's, he's not good. I'd say he's on the bad side of Umbrella. Carlos is on the good side of Umbrella, not knowing that it's actually bad. I have faith that he's good. He seems like a nice guy. All right. Should I give her the Tyrell, first? Where's Bard now? Oh. Gotta be the lab in the back. Stay frosty. I'm on my way. Copy. I'll go on ahead. Okay, should I give her a first aid thing? Like, do you think that'll help her? Oh, okay. She's not doing so good. It's okay, Jill. We'll find a cure. Somewhere in this hospital. The lobby. Hello. Ooh, 
those D's. Oh my god. How am I getting so many of these? Look at these. I have three. I've, wh why can't Jill get stuff like that? She's the one that has Nemesis. <laughs> Could've used those first aid sprays during my fight with Nemesis, that's for sure. Uh oh, we got some hospital zombies. Hospital zombies! And I don't have a lockpick. We're gonna have to find a lockpick, apparently. Spencer Memorial Pamphlet. Welcome to Spencer Memorial Hospital, the heart of Raccoon City. Healthcare and forefront of science. Spencer Memorial Hospital was meticulously designed by the Spencer Foundation to serve as the backbone of medical care throughout the region. In addition to our state-of-the-art outpatient wing and spacious inpatient wing, we boast one of the country's largest research wings, where we conduct clinical trials for new drugs that will change the face of medicine across the United States and the world. Sa smells like umbrella to me, that's, that's for sure. I don't got time for this! I love Carlos! <laughs> I got no time for this. He's saying it how it is. Uh, I mean, I could use a flash grenade. I mean, wait. Oh, that's what was... Flash! Boom, baby! Y'all been stunned! Now what? Okay. I'll have to deal with them later. But at least I got them away for now. Another lockpick. Dang it. That is a creepy noise that I don't like. No thanks. Oh, thank you. What is that? What is that noise? What is that noise? Like the noises. Please state your business clearly into the intercom. Nurses Journal, September twenty fifth. Every day they bring in more of these mystery illness patients. The sedatives don't stop their delirium, so we have to put them in straitjackets and move them to the isolation wing. Problem is, the isolation wing is already bursting at the seams. The director has ordered us to admit anyone with symptoms free of charge, but what does he expect us to do? Wish them better? We don't have a cure. And that's not all that's bothering me. With these, When these patients die, they're not collected by the usual uh, mortuary teams. We've been told it's special handling to prevent the illness from spreading, but I'm not sure I buy it. Miranda saw some guys wheeling a body through the forbidden door during the night. Why? Where? What's going on? This is sketchy. This is sketchy. Tape player. You'll have to put it on tape. Put a tape on it for it to work? Oh, okay. All right. All right. Um, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to. Doctor Bard, are you in there? I'm here to rescue you. Open the door. No voice match found. Voice match? What kind of sci-fi bullshit is this? Hmm. Huh. Uh. Ooh. 
Music's getting creepy. Oh, hello. Hello, everyone. Lovely. I wish I had a grenade. Grenade would be very nice right now. This guy is real upset. Do you want me to let you in? Oh, all right. I guess I can't let you in. I tried. What? there. Oh, uh, no. I want the handgun ammo. Okay. I guess I got it. I love, I love Carlos's grunt of frustration. He's like, <laughs> Oh, This way, bud. I, I, I'm sorry. I can't. I, I would let you out. I tried. It's not. I, I. All right. He's just gonna have to wait. What? What, what is that noise? Too? Oh my goodness. <laughs> me too, Carlos. Me too. Ah. Oh, what the F? Are you coming up? Are you? Alright. Apparently you're sleeping. They're sleeping for now. I wonder if there's going to be a new enemy here. I don't like the sound of this. Hey! I miss so many dolls as Jill. I don't. I don't even know if I got any as her. This is a safe room. Journals. Nurse's journal. Admitted over 20 mysterious illness patients. Patients in the isolation wing exhibiting severe limb necrosis, fever, muttering delirium, and signs of hyperphagia. Possible infection? Tried every antiseptic. Still no blood work back from the research wing. Ask again. Dr. Young was bitten while treating one of the patients. We've disinfected the wound, but his fever won't go down. Nothing works. Meanwhile, the outpatient wing is complete anarchy. The patients are delirious and growing more violent by the minute. We've called in our off-duty staff. It's all hands on deck now. We have gotten- we've got to contain this chaos. That sucks. These people are just trying to do their job. Okay. I don't know what to do. Like, I got so many things. 
What do I have? I'm, I'm fine. I'm like completely fine. Oops. Wait, what? I uh, guess I'm good. Maybe there's maybe there's liquors in the hospital. Maybe. Spencer Memorial Hospital map. All right. Uh oh, that doesn't sound good. Staff room. Uh oh. Oh, oh, maybe you're, maybe you're right. Maybe there are liquors because there's claw marks. There are claw marks on the wall. Wow, everybody got murdered. I need a lock pick. The F. Don't tell me I missed the lock pick. <sighs> Memos for administration. ID card rules. ID cards are not to be taken off hospital grounds under any circumstances. As per our security measures, all employees must store their ID card in their own personal lockers before returning home for the day. Thank you. The key to the locker room has gone missing. The last person to have it may have dropped it somewhere in the courtyard. If it is recovered, we will keep a spare key here in the office. Please stop by administration at the end of your shift to borrow it. Hmm. Okay. So the key is either potentially here or the courtyard. I don't think I... Oh. Nurse's journal. We tried. I swear to God we did. But there's nothing else to be done. The chaos is completely beyond control. Victims are pouring in now, dying and spreading the infection faster than we can reach them. So we've given up trying. Those of us who aren't infected have barricaded ourselves in here. We can hear the cries for help outside, the screaming, but none of us will go out there because it would be the end of us. I can't believe we've ab abandoned our patients. It's the worst sin imaginable for a nurse. I can't stop shaking, but I want to live. I want to live. We heard a helicopter flying overhead and immediately started crying and hugging each other, thinking a rescue team was on the way. But then the sound grew distant, and we were all left, left with now is the moaning of the dead and the silent screams in our hearts. We're all about to lose our minds. Dr. Young, Ariana, Miranda, Dakota, I'm so sorry I failed you. Something's coming. Help me. Yikes. Big yikes. Okay, well, I, I can't do anything here. find the courtyard. What is this music? What is this music? Someone's trying to get in here. A lot of people. Ooh, there's a safe. We gotta find the code for the safe. Note about a tape recording. Dakota, I think I know what happened to the missing tape of Dr. B. His research assistant took it. 
One of my patients saw Abbott move, remove something from a locker in the nurse's station and walk toward the treatment room. I'll try to sneak in and look during the night shift. You just stay cool and keep doing your job. I don't care how important <sighs> Dr. B is to the medical community. That kind of harassment is not okay. I promise I won't let them destroy the evidence. He's a pig and an asshole, and I will get his day in court. Stay brave, stay strong, a friend. Interesting. All right, dude. Are you guys coming in here or what? Really? Okay. You are coming in here. <laughs> he tripped. Oh, I'm sorry, man. need to find a code for the safe. Looks like this needs the ID card. Oh, come on. I knew it! I knew it! Hand grenade! That's useful. Very nice, very nice. I think Leon had a similar gun to this one, didn't he? Alright, I think that's it for this room. Yes. Alright. Gotta keep my eyes open for a combination of some sort. For a safe. Ooh. Oh, hello! Oh! Okay! That just happened. Oh no! Wait, what? Can I? Wait. No! I... Carlos, I wanna go back! Dang it, Carlos! I don't need all these herbs. I'm gonna eat one. I can't. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm discarding it. I don't know what that item was. Okay. All right. So we were here. All right. So now
Open sesame. No voice match found. <laughs> okay, we gotta go back this way. I think. I'm going the wrong way. I'm going back to where I was. I want to know if I can jump over. No? Can't? Okay, so one-way thing? I I think Carlos could jump over, but that whatever. Apparently not. Alright. Go back up the stairs. here before. Where are you? Okay. I think he's done. I don't know if she's gonna get infected. Like, for good or not. Oh, look at that. We have too many things. We're just too prepared. I need to get rid of this key. I guess we'll put this stuff away. Wait. I went the wrong way. This way. This way. That's true. No such thing as being too prepared. I think I feel like I have way too much health as Carlos. Like I haven't really been hit much. Like I I I just get a lot of health. Look at all these lockers. Okay. attacking he's just he's there for the jump scare come on dude really oh my goodness okay now that we have this card we can go to so many things i need a lock pick though oh my goodness that got me good i i'm afraid that i missed the lock pick like, did I not, did I not get it at the police station? Was I supposed to get it there? These noises are very ominous. Looking for a code for that. Um, safe. This is not a good sign. Oh dear! <gasps> what? What are you? What? You're new. Ew. What the heck? Oh 
I don't know what to do with you, but we're just gonna... We're just gonna... So you're not a licker, you're something else. Die, bitch! Die, bitch! I'm running out of ammo. I'm running out of ammo. Oh no! What? What? <laughs> yeah, but I... The fact that there are lockers that you have to open, but you're at, but you're Carlos, that makes me think that I, I open them as Carlos. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Alright, let's try that again. Oh! Apparently if he attacks you- Okay, so the first time I died, I wasn't even, like, close to death. Like, I was literally fine. So apparently he just- you just can't let him hit you from behind. It's possible to break through its armored shell to reveal its vulnerable head. Keep out of reach of deadly strikes. Yeah, okay, so it has a deadly strike. So if it hits you from the back, um, you're dead. All right, I'm cornered. I'm cornered! All right, so that's a deadly strike. All right. I gotta figure out how to block that. I, there's no way to block in this game, but yeah. I guess I can start with the grenade and just see how that works. Die, beach. Wow, the grenade did it. Really? All right. I guess that works. It's it's dead for now. Good to know. Good to know. That works. I know, I'm surprised it was that easy. I honestly thought it would be harder than that. <laughs> That's like when I fought those things in the sewer and it was like one fire launcher and that was it. I'm sure there will be more of them. Okay. Except now I don't have any grenades. <laughs> mm. Handgun ammo. Where? Two. the roof. What is the safe? I gotta figure out what's the safe. Here we go. Are you gonna burst through the window like a crazy? Oh. Oh, there's two in there. <gasps> oh no. That's not good. Let's just uh, be quiet. Maybe it won't notice us. Yikes.
The tr oh, it's the treatment room. That's where they are. Oh, hello. Red herb. So if I go in the treatment room, that's where they all are. <laughs> Probably don't want to do that. But I think I have to. Here goes it. Hey, hey, you know. <laughs> yeah, I wonder if I can. Ah! You can open the door? <gasps> what? Oh, snap. Oh, come on. How do I avoid that? It's like literally, it's like an instant kill. It literally is, it's an instant kill. And it's both directions. It's facing in front of you and it's behind you. Like, I don't like these guys. I don't like them. I gotta figure out what to do. Yeah, it says having acid, acid rounds can melt through its, its shell. Like, okay, cool, I don't have that. I, I have, I have this gun and this gun. This, this is all I got. Was it? <laughs> it closed the tour and then it killed me. Very sad. Beach. Dude. It's one thing if it if it hits me and like okay fine I'll I'll recover I'll heal but when it like instant kills you that's where I get stuck Go save again before we deal with these bozos. Like, look at all these heels. It's ridiculous. I don't even know what to do. Look at them all. I got so many. What the hell? I think I have to get something in that room, though. There must be a reason why they're in there. I'm sure there's an item or something. I must know. Wrong room. Wrong room! Alright. <laughs> I 
Bitch, I killed you. I thought. I thought I did. Apparently not. <laughs> okay. Alright, we have a flash grenade. I'm gonna throw it. Oh dear. Oh dear. Is there anything in here? What's this? See? We needed this. We needed this tape. We needed it to complete the, uh, the thing. Aha! <sighs> okay, we got that. Is that all that's in here? Please. Assault rifle ammo. That's it. Alright, get out of here! Get out of my way! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know what? I'm gonna just leave and, and hope for the best. <laughs> I think I got what I needed from that room. We're good. this side oops I still want to know what's on the other side <laughs> oh look at them all <gasps> Wow, what the frick? What on earth did I just pick up? I picked up two hand grenades? Look at this. Are you kidding me? What? How many are there? There's like three. Alright, we can do this. We can do this. Okay, where's the other guys? Is there anything? There's nothing else in here. We're good. More green herb. <laughs> Just what I needed. And another lockpick. And another lockpick. Very nice. Oh! <laughs> I got you with my knife! I thought that was good enough. You are donezo. Whoa, hello. Hello there. Hello. Hello, everyone. Lovely. Okay. We're done. We're done in here. I know, we gotta go back that way, though. But I wanted to see what's on the other side of the courtyard. out here bitch you're not supposed to be out here oh what the f what the f okay 
I guess we're going back to that room. <gasps> I do have a hand grenade. That would kill it in one 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 hit. documents were doing in your office in the first place. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm goddamn Nathaniel Bard. I'm the best biologist you'll ever meet, <laughs> you bedpan changing waste of a nursing degree. Of course I have connections higher up. Of course the military consults with me on projects beyond your comprehension. So stop wasting my time with your nosy questions. I... Uh, I'm sorry, doctor. You didn't read the documents, did you? No, I shredded them just like you asked. Good. Good. Huh. If that's all, you can go back to wiping your patient's ass. That's what they pay you for, right? And polish my shoes. Wow. Yes, sir. What an asshole. I bet you know a lot about polishing, don't you? Now fuck off and don't say a word to anyone. Wow. Wow. What a douche. Saying it like it is, Carlos. Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, okay. Oh, is that him? Ha! Ah. Banquet invitation. Dear Dr. Bard, it is my pleasure to coordinately invite, invite you to a banquet on September 10th at the Central Hotel, we, where we will be exchanging viewpoints on Raccoon City's new special media zone, SMZ. Attending will be Mayor Michael Warren, Chief of Police, P Police Brian Irons, who is that creepy guy from Resident Evil 2, the terrible man. And another distinguished members of the community. Thursday, September 10th. Hotel, we would be honored if you would join us. United States Senator. Neat. I'll be introducing the bill for that new drug of yours in mid-August to bring the cash. We've booked a suite for the u usual after party. You're the brunette. You're a brunette guy, right? I'll let Irons know. Ew. God. These guys are terrible. Bard. Tyrell. Bard's dead. He's been shot. Shit. And the vaccine? I'm looking. Well, look harder. There's gotta be a computer, right? Well, at least he's not a zombie. Some, I don't know if he... I'm assuming he got killed. Like he... Someone killed him. Email from Nathaniel Bard to Greg Tester, who's the, uh, is he the politician? The, the governor? Greg, I know you're watching the news. Oh. This virus is going to devour the whole country. The dead will wash over Capitol Hill like a tidal wave. You're not safe. However, you've always been a good friend to me, so I'd like to offer you a way out. I have in my possession one dose of a vaccine for the virus, the Holy Grail, and it's not for my family, not for my ladies on the side. No, Greg, I'm saving it for you. I know better than anyone that you're the future of the United States, but if you want the goods, Greg, you have got to get me the hell out of here now without Umbrella finding out. Lean on the Pentagon for me. I know you've got the clout. See if someone can get a rescue team in here with the, without UBCS involvement. You scratch my back, I scratch yours. Which should sound pretty chaste after the parties we've been to. Hurry, my time is running out. Okay, then. Well, this we need... This is the RC Chief, Nathaniel Bard. September 29, 11 p.m. I am acutely aware that my time's running out. And I hope and pray, by making this recording and bringing the truth to light, 
that I can restore some small shred of honor to my name. All of Raccoon City's suffering began with the release of a biological weapon known as the T-Virus. My employer, the Umbrella Corporation, engineered this virus, and they ordered my team to develop a vaccine, which we did. Now, I keep samples of this vaccine here in my office. The rest of it is stored underground. We're underground. The of bitches at the board. They want to destroy it. They don't want the world to know what they've done. So they're trying to erase all evidence that the virus ever existed. No, I'm not a fool. I know they don't want me to... Someone's coming in. <gasps> and then someone came in and shot him. Hmm. She knew all along. And she trusted me anyway. Aww. Fuck! Carlos! It's okay, Carlos. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. The company you work for is really bad. They're very bad. Is it here? He's so desperate. Vaccine sample. Uh, okay. I almost thought I didn't have right, Jill. room. Hang tight. <gasps> yes, we must return to Jill. T, I got it. Good. I'm headed your way. Be careful. Careful? <laughs> have you seen this town? It'll be a fucking miracle if I get there in one piece. Oh dear. Oh dear. All right. You know what? I got two two grenades. Let's No, not combine. Let's shortcut them over here. So in case I run into one of those things, I can use one. <gasps> like that. How did I jump? I even saw it like freaking Oh shit. I thought it would hurt me in the process. I'm fine. I am totally fine. <laughs> oh man. We're gonna save Jill. That's the last thing Carlos does. Oh my goodness. You know, I never did find the uh, I thought you would make your uh, I'm dead pose. Uh. All right. Um Oh, we didn't get that door yet. So many lock picks and safes. I still haven't found the 3 digit thing for the safe. So, I don't know. Oh, hello. Hi. Hi everyone. Oh, that's right. I threw a I flew through a flat fl <laughs> flash grenade at you and then I ran away. That's what happened. Lovely. I want to go this way. Dang it! <laughs> I need another lockpick. Oh my goodness. I'm hoping we get to play as Jill in this hospital because there's so many freaking things to open with the lockpick. You're gonna be okay, Jill. 
<gasps> Yay! You're gonna be okay, Jill. I got you. Wait. What did I just do? Good, go. Let's save. Whew. Use. Ouch. Is that, okay. What if he what if he injected it in like the wrong area of the body? <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> I'm sure it's fine. Ah, uh, I wonder how long uh, it took. Hey, bud. Tyrell. Yay! He made it. How happened? Attention, all citizens. The contagion spreading throughout the city has been designated uncontainable. On October first. Raccoon City will be completely destroyed in a missile strike. All residents capable of rational thought are urged to evacuate immediately. This is not a test. Attention all citizens. I mean, that's only a day away. There's still people in the city. You think Uncle Sam gives a shit? Fuck. Here they come. Trying to, just trying to cover up all the evidence. Tight. I got this. By just blowing up the entire city. Wow! Gear. Sounds like there's a lot of them out there. Oh dear. Okay. Um I mean, I guess I'll get another <laughs> so many freaking healths. I don't even know what to do with them all. Jill, it's gonna be okay. He's tired too. Dude, Carlos is tired. I'm gonna try to lower the window shutters. The less entry points, the better. And how do we do that? I'll try hacking into the hospital security system. Keep them off me in the meantime. My goodness. Huh. Oh my goodness. What? Now the fun shit begins. Oh my god! What? What? What is this? What is this? Oh, a detonator. Oh. Okay. I'm not sure where to put it, but okay. What am I? Most people are dead. But not all of them. Oh shit. pretty badass. Carlos is a badass. I am a big fan. Oh, it's sparking again. Are you- can you get hit, please? Ah! What the fuck? Wait, what? Did he just explode into nothing? I do not need this. Where am I supposed to detonate the... I don't... I don't really know. Oh, wait, what? No, they're not. No, they're not. Get out of here. Bitches. Hey, hey, hey. Dang it. Oh, come on. 
Find the breaker? What? What do you mean, breaker? <sighs> 81 bullets of assault rifle ammo? Yes, please. Hang on, what's my health? We're fine. We don't even need... Oh, I like the ammo, though. All right, let's get rid of this handgun ammo, because we don't even need it. Let's skip this. <gasps> what the fuck? Are you kidding me? Bitch. Hang on. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, God. Oh. Die, bitch! Holy shit. Alright, we got this? Okay, we gotta get the breaker. Oh, what the fuck. Look at all this shit. I- look at how much they're giving me. Are you kidding me? I don't have room for you. Goodbye. Oh, uh, well. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Ridiculous. Look at all this shit. Oh, finally we get a hip pouch. Oh. Might as well. Where's the breaker room? That's what I need to know. Oh, what the fuck? So far, so good. So, am I supposed to go somewhere? Am I supposed to go here? No. Ah! Shit. No, I meant to use the fucking... Ah, dang it. Saving my grenades for the other dudes. There. Now I just gotta clean up.
Hey, come on. Are you done? Are we good? Excuse me? Hold out until the explosion. Nice. I have no idea how long that is, but let's find out. Oh, t okay, 25 seconds. All right, we can do that. We're good. We're all good. Everything's great. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. You all right? Not even close. But at least it's over. Oh. Coming back. The trophy's called I Need a Hero. I Need a Hero. Maxine's a real deal. Yay. Good. You going somewhere? You damn right. What do you think you're going to do? Whole city's about to be microwaved. Come on, man. Call the government. Tell them we found a cure. You stall for time. Bozy motherfucker. <laughs> Aw, Carlos is leaving when Joe wakes up. All right, well, hopefully they'll see each other after this. <laughs>